airsoft shops closed, Takemi clinics shut down for summer vacation. Where are we gonna get our weapons and medicine now? Talk about shitty timing. This is not good. We can't just return to the Metaverse defenseless. I guess we gotta find some other stores. And that seems like it'll take quite some time. What's up? Have a problem? Perhaps I can help. If you would like, I'm happy to lend a hand. Oh yeah! Check this out, Sophia. We need supplies to take with us into the jail. Unfortunately, our usual suppliers are closed. This will assuredly impact our successes in the Metaverse. Do you know if there are any suitable stores nearby? Why not just order supplies online? We could do that, but the delay between ordering and actually getting the stuff is way too long. Also, we were able to get much more effective medicines from our clinic than we could find online. No prob. The net has it all. Ryuji, is there something you want? Huh? What do I want? Right. Request anything you want. Uh, okay. A gold bar. <sighs> really? Don't be ridiculous. Ah, come on. It was just a joke. Nothing else popped into my head when she asked, so... Okay, I've got it. Please wait. Hmm? Got what? Hello? Expedited delivery! Well, uh, did you really order a gold bar? Uh... Whoa! <laughs> well, someone should open it. Gee, this is your doing! Open it! What? Me? Of course! <laughs> Wait, it is, right? Shit, this is probably just gonna be fake or some toy. <laughs> is that real? Holy shit, what am I doing? <laughs> yes, my eyes can't be fooled. There's no doubt. That's real gold. No way. No way is that real. <laughs> wow, now I can open my cafe early. It's like a dream. <laughs> but that needs to go to the police. Right away. Oh, wait. They even believe it showed up like this? Is this a crime? It's okay, everybody. All right. Did that solve your problem? I found an online vendor with expedited delivery. Time is no longer a concern. But a whole gold bar? Where'd you find that? The dark web? Correct, Futaba. It's fine. I broke no laws. The transaction was made with cryptocurrency. I will send you an invoice for reimbursement. We have to reimburse you? So, uh, how much did this cost again? At least a few million. Send it back? Sorry, I didn't get that. Send the other thing back! Hello, expedited pickup. Thank you for choosing our services. <sighs> I'm relieved they took it back, but uh, that definitely gave us some gray hairs. Jeez, uh, thanks a lot for ordering that, Ryuji. Oh, come on, who would have thought a gold bar would actually show up here? I've heard of one's mouth writing checks that cannot be cashed, but this is an entirely new level. Doesn't the service itself seem pretty awesome, though? That speed, it'll be perfect for anything we need. Let's ask Sophia to find some useful stuff for us. Shall I do that? Okay, I'll make sure to use expedited delivery. Sophia's shop is officially open. Right, but I guess it turned out okay for us. Yeah, our supply situation's definitely fine now. We don't know what we'll be up against in the jail, though. 
Let's prepare as well as we can. Alright, let's begin the operation. Our first goal would be the treasure room, yes? I'm sensing something treasure-like over here. That way, towards 705. That's where you were taken when they captured you, right? Yeah. Just thinking about it pisses me off. Piece of shit was so full of herself. So, Alice is there now, huh? You know, it does sort of look like a castle. A castle ruled by a monarch. I admit, it's rather fitting. So, we're heading to the castle? Yeah, that sounds good. This jail is crawling with shadows. Watch your backs out. Okay, I'll watch your backs out there. <laughs> Sophie's inaugural heist is a phantom thief. This'll be great. We don't know the opposition will face. Be sure to switch out team members when necessary. Good point. We're at your beck and call, Joker. Be careful. They've got serious numbers. Don't you remember what to do at times like this? Watch for an opening, then jump it from behind. Be careful not to get spotted. Show me your true self! <laughs> was a real success. Indeed. It's been quite some time since we fought last, but my body is still ready for more. They'll go a lot smoother whenever we ambush them like that, too. The other hand. If we're spotted, they'll get the upper hand against us. Keep sharp out there. I guess now we just push forward and see what we see. Navigator at the ready. Hang on there. Searchlights confirmed. Getting spotted by one of those will mean big trouble. Surrounded in no time. Shadows are patrolling too. No surprise. Security is tight here. A frontal assault sounds like it might be out of the picture. Let's see if we have anything else here. Maybe we can get in there. Wait, if we run along there, getting in the castle should be a cinch. If there are more searchlights, how will we get past? Smaller than the other ones, why don't we just try sneaking past? <laughs> oh shit! We can't go any further! They're firing on anything within range! Oracle, can you find a way to shut them down? Just a sec. Analyzing. Hmm. Yes! Got it! The searchlight's power source is south of here. South? Yeah, which way is that? In reality, it'd be somewhere around Maruku City. Must be some sort of facility providing power over there. Alright, off to Maruku City. Let's move out! The jail looks like Shibuya, but the layout isn't exactly the same. I'm worried we'll get ourselves lost. on your location, or that'll probably happen. Maruku City's straight ahead from here. I'll highlight it on your map. Wait, Sentry! Ah, great. Once that thing sees us, shadows are just gonna start pouring in! We should avoid all head-on conflict when possible. Life only gets harder when they're on high alert. And if we're spotted too many times, we'll have no choice but to come back later. Here as well. So just 
have to take that one out. Looks like it hasn't noticed us yet, though. Joker, think you could pull off an ambush from over there? Oh, a treasure chest! Shit, yeah! Let's stop those guys and loot that thing! Wait, that treasure chest has a security system. If the security level here gets too high, the chest is shielded until things quiet back down again. If enemies spot us too many times, no treasure for us. Got it. The enemy hasn't noticed us. Now's our chance. Looks like the enemy's panicking. We got it! They put up a fair that. Let's get going. Stop! Maruku City's right here. And on the other side of that? I don't see a way to open the gate either. Looks like we need an alternative. Such as? I don't think we'll be able to climb that. Look over there. What if we tried going up that way? At the very least, we might spot a way around this from up there. Good idea. Let's pop on up! Hmm... Treasure? No, I'm not getting treasure vibes from it. it. Looks the same. It's actually totally different. I'm picking up a really strong reading from it. It's connected to the searchlights, too. If we take it, I think we'll cut the power to the searchlights. It seems that is our next step. Let us advance towards the tower. But how do we get up that thing? I think I see anything resembling an entrance. Sure, we can all fly here. Suggestion, why not approach from below? How so? Below us is an underground waterway, remember? All right, nice call! That sounds like the best idea to me, too. Let's do it. We should make haste. One moment. Something is nearby. Something? What kind of something? It is a... space... connected to... somewhere. Hmm? Hey, Sophie! You're right! It's like the space here is being warped and connected to... the crossing? As in, the crossing where we first entered the jail? So, if we use this, we'll go back to the entrance? Sounds like moving between the jail and the real world will make our resupply efforts at least a bit easier. That's it! I'm calling this a checkpoint. Go ahead and give it a spin so the location data registers. It looks like this tunnel eventually leads right under Maruku City. Tunnel? Looks more like a sewer to me. And there's no easy way to get to the other side. Well, looks like we're swimming. No, no, no. I am not swimming in that. Ugh, not happening! I would prefer not to as well. Can't we search for another way? Hey, check out the grate. What do you think? Could we use that to get around? Yeah, it's worth a try. I'll bet that leads to the surface. Who the hell are you? Ah, busted! Can't have these guys raise a fuss about us. 
Get rid of him, quick! Go on stamina! Be careful! Whose desires were taken? I see some familiar faces. There's no doubt these are the same victims. So we've discovered where they're being held. We have to rescue them! No. Considering their behavior, it wouldn't help letting them out now. If they've lost their minds from having their desires stolen, they'll need them returned first. Shit! How could someone do this to people? Where'd you come from? Let's get him, Joker! That was the searchlight's power source. Is that a dress? It is rather cute. I've seen this before. It's a dress in Alice's lineup. I recognize it from a fashion magazine. Wait, that dress made the searchlights move? Doesn't make any sense. Well, we're in the cognitive world. Maybe it holds some sort of power here? could represent the power of a monarch. One could say that Alice's brand is, in essence, what allowed her to become what she is today. Proof of her dominance here. And this core must be the power source for the jail's equipment. Well, now that we have it, the searchlights should be off, right? 
Ah, uh, looks like two of them are still up and running. They've got their own cores powering them. The first one is east of here. Real world location wise, I'd say around Mia Mai Park. What a pain in the ass. Well, let's get it over with. I wonder if the other cores are in jail cell covered towers like this one. Some form of shorthand reference would be more convenient. How does incarceration zone sound? Incarceration? What? Dude, why the hell would we call it that? These places are for protecting the jail's power sources, say. How about prison keeps? What? Okay, let's go. This is where me and my park is in the real world. Is that our current destination? Well, that didn't take long. This one doesn't appear any easier to breach, though. Looks like we're taking the long way around. Security is going to be tight. Let's stay sharp. But this is. Uh oh, busted! Take him out before they call for backup. Hey, check out the skateboard. You like studying some shadows? It's possible. I say you can go down a whole bunch of shadows if you did it right. We're safe for now. I can't see an entrance. Maybe we should gain some elevation. That spot seems rather odd. Maybe we'll find something useful there. Come on, let's check it out.
Next work. Now to infiltrate the key. Any hacking attempts here are met with reinforcements. Let's make sure Oracle's as prepared as possible from here on out. Wait! Incoming shadows! How'd you get in here? Where are the guards? In Her Majesty's name, you shall go no further! Magazine. A widely recognized symbol of power. Mona's theory is being proven with each turn. She would have been famous even if she hadn't started doing all this. Panther. Then what reason did she have? Does she even have one at all? Whatever the case, the next core is the last one. It's just a bit west of here, over by Bunkamachi. 
Kamachi. That's quite the cultural hotspot. Returning to Shibuya Crossing and using Central Street would probably be the quickest. So this is the final person key. The walls are just as high as the others. I suspect the gate is closed just as with the others. How will we breach the keep? Perhaps we can leap over there from another rooftop? Let's try gaining some elevation. Find a point of entry. Hey, there! That string of flags leads all the way to the keep. Think we could slide down it to get over there? Mm. Doesn't look taut enough for us to use like that. But what if we gave the Ferris wheel a spin? Would that tighten it up? You know, that could work. Let's head over there and check it out. Who are you? What are you doing here?
Stamina's all but run drop. <laughs> for the Ferris wheel. Can you power it up, Oracle? We don't have to go hunting for more generators, do we? Nope. Looks like we're good here. It's already too up for us. Perhaps the Ferris wheel's connected to the same generators. Then everything turned out great for us. Can you... All right! Ferris wheel! Activate! Whoa. You did it! Now we can enter the prison. What are you doing here? We've come to relieve you of your duty. Take him down and the core is ours. You guys are close to the prison. Can anyone heal? Look at their numbers. Damn it, what is this? We can't reach the castle. Well, we just finished up the searchlights, too. Guess we did wreak some real havoc here. Looks like we've finally gotten Alice's full attention. Oracle, any guidance for us? Uh, this is a real toughie. I'm not seeing any alternate paths right now. Staying here will only get us surrounded. Joker, what's your call? no other choice. Let's get back to reality and figure out our next step there. It's 
It's grown quite late, hasn't it? Oh, man, what are we gonna do? The wall ain't going anywhere. Wait. A more pressing issue's arisen. I'm quite famished. Wow, what an issue. Come on, dude, get real. Oh, on second thought, I'm famished, too. <laughs> Let's get something to eat. We can't have any good ideas on empty stomachs. Hungry? I'll find a restaurant for you. No need, Sophia. Our target's already been decided. Sojiro's courier bot! I bet he'll hook all of you up, too. Do you mean it? Uh, take it easy on Boss, okay? He's already treated us plenty. Uh, I don't even care. What's that? A fight? All those stupid bastards uh, making me look like crap. Oh, it's okay, sir. Hey, kids, get out of the way. <sighs> Just some plastered suit. Huh? Hey, what are these little shits doing out? Hey, hey you're a real wonder. How's about you and I go back to my place? And <laughs> hey, cut it out! Uh, you think that's gonna scare me? Please! Don't work him up any worse than he is already! What? He's the one who started it! Oh, that's it. I'm gonna... I'm gonna teach you all some manners! If you don't walk away... All right, break it up. That's enough. What the hell is this? Hmm, how should I put it? I'm just a knight in shining armor. Uh, what? That's weird. Knight in shining armor, my ass! I'm gonna punch your lights out. Careful now. Ooh, you really ate it there. You okay? Um, you totally knocked him on his ass? Oh, come on. You totally saw it. That was legitimate self-defense. Hey, this is assault. Uh, you want me to call the police? I am the police. Now scram. What? A cop? Ah, I'm so sorry. No, wait. Take this guy with you. Wow, not a great support. <sighs> I guess this guy will come to eventually. <sighs> well, folks, you all right now? You saw the badge, right? Not all cops wear uniforms, you know. Don't get too chummy. This man is most likely with public security. Ooh, good guess. Although, it may be more like common knowledge, considering the number of tails on you. For example, you noticed the one over there yet? Dumbass, what are you doing? <laughs> Sorry, my bad. Could you bring this drunk in for me? What? The hell is with this guy? Suspicion levels off the charts. What does someone from public security want with us? Oh, no need for that look. I actually do have a reason to be here. I need to speak with you. Let's say we grab some coffee over there. Their curry's pretty killer, too. Enjoy. Sorry about that. We just despise the police is all. It, it's kind of weird when you say it with a smile like that. So, why'd you rescue us? We'd appreciate it if you'd get to the point. Fine, fine. I'll skip the runaround and just tell you. I'm Zenkichi Hasegawa, an investigator on loan to Tokyo's public security branch. I'm officially an inspector. It's not a rank to sneeze at. Inspectors are not to be sneezed at. Okay, I've got it. Uh, who said that? Ah, whatever. I need to ask you something. Did you hear at all about that mess on the chat show the other day? 
with Alice Hiragi. I can't believe you just told me that. You sure you're on the same page as them? Well, there's already been a full investigation into the incident. There was no indication the MC was planning to propose. Everyone questioned said he didn't even know who Alice was before this week. Not only that, he'd already been engaged to his co-host for however long. There isn't a whiff of motive to be found. So, the police have concluded, doesn't this sound like the work of the Phantom Thieves? Wait, you're saying... A whole lot of similar cases last year, no? Sudden personality shifts, abnormal behavior, psychotic breakdowns. If that MC went bonkers from a change of heart, you're gonna be suspect number one. The leader of the Phantom Thieves of Hearts. We don't know if it's drugs or hypnosis or what, but they want to charge you with criminal mischief. It's only a matter of time before you're arrested. But why? This is outrageous. What proof do you have? Sure it's outrageous, but we don't actually have any proof yet. That's why I'm here. So, level with me. Are you? Huh? Are you the one doing this? Hell no, dude! Yeah, yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, <laughs> just a second. Ah, uh, hello, Commissioner. Yes, I'm with the Phantom Thieves leader. I just asked for a confession, but he says he's innocent. Yes, that's right. <laughs> huh? Kidding? No, no, this is all real. That's enough nonsense? Oh, okay. I'm on my way to the office. Well, as you saw, I reported what you said to my boss. But if you ask me, mm, I don't think she's convinced. Did he really call his boss? Holy shit. He's with this guy. What are you trying to prove here? No matter how hard you claim to be innocent, there are people out there chomping at the bit to arrest you. If that ever happens, you're done for. And I'll be up the river too, because then this case will never get solved. So I wanted to make you an offer. Or maybe, more like a deal. A deal with you? I want to solve this case. To do that, I need the intel you've gathered. At the moment, I don't have anything that even resembles a lead. I'm totally at a loss. You, though, you just don't want to get arrested. I can do what needs to be done, so that won't happen. Your old men are a trustworthy lot in the force. There won't be any problems. Sound like a fair deal to you? I appreciate you trying to see the benefit here. I really don't think it's a bad deal for you. Dude, hang on. You really think we should trust someone this shady? You know how they say the wise cat hides its claws? Let's just say that applies to me, too. I've literally never heard that. What do you think? You don't have to do anything until you decide whether you trust him or not. That sure is a noisy cat. Uh, <clears throat> meow! Well, I don't need an answer right away. Get back to me once you think it over. I hope you'll see things my way, Phantom Thieves. All right, boss. Mm, be back soon for some curry. Sorry, the curry's 86th. For you. Oh, now that hurts. <laughs> what is with that guy? Oh, he is absolutely ridiculous. He appears to have a great many bats in his belfry. Zenkichi Hasegawa? What a cool name for such a dweeb. But if he was telling the truth just now, they're gonna arrest him? Ah, uh, what a bullshit deal! I say it's more of a threat. Without a doubt, it still beats having him arrested. Walking into a trap isn't smart, but the intel might still pay off for us. Now that we know the police are on the move, we've already benefited from that guy. But now, the big question, how much can we trust him? Always thinking five steps ahead, huh? Still, we should be extra careful here. So, fess up. What'd you do this time? Mm, nothing. No worries, Sojiro. This is about that Alice girl, right? You're suspected of causing that whole mess on TV somehow. Is that it? Ugh. 
But it's totally bull. We know Alice is the one doing it. We are sorry, boss. We really didn't want to bother you again. Well, you didn't do it, right? So keep your chin up. If it's totally bull, then it's up to you to prove it. Boss! Chief really nailed it there. If you need anything, just let me know. Aw, thank you, Sojiro. First things first, we take care of Alice. We can respond to the detective later. If Alice publicly admits to what she's been doing, it should clear our name anyway. Oh, right. Then we wouldn't even need to make a deal with him. Nevertheless, we've yet to find a way to get closer to Alice's castle. That wall really is our biggest problem. In trouble? I can help. I'm trying to figure out a way past that damn wall. I'm sorry. I don't have a solution to that. How about hacking it, Utaba? Hmm, I could probably do something if it's linked directly to a terminal, but... A terminal? There is a control panel on the other side of the wall. What? Really? It was saved in my memory when we first confronted it. Therefore, really. Damn, I can't believe you remember that. What an eye, huh, guys? It's A-I. Hmm? Who are you talking to? Have a friend on the phone? It's just your imagination, Sojiro. Hmm. It's almost like I've had my shop swiped from under my butt. That means you can lock up for me, right? I'm about to head out. And don't stay up too late, either. Got it? Roger. Well, don't overdo it. Now we have to figure out how we're going to get Futaba on the other side of the wall. Perhaps we could climb it with her? I don't think it's too high for us. There are too many searchlights in the area. We'd be quickly surrounded. We're going to need a decoy to put a dent in their defenses for us. One decoy? Or what do you think could actually pull that off? Who could be a decoy by themselves? huge commotion to draw as much of the Shadow's attention as you can for us. This still sounds too dangerous, even for him. Shouldn't someone back him up? I can provide support. I will divide the enemy's attention between him and myself. This will lighten the burden placed upon you. Okay, I won't push myself too hard. Alright, we've got a plan. Now we just have to assign roles to the rest of the team. 